Hey there, guys. How's it going? Flimmon14 here. And, uh, yeah, last episode we uh, did some free duels against uh, Deckmaster K here. Got a, uh, a couple losses, one win. Basically, we're just kind of showing you guys how the game works. Uh, in this episode, we're going to continue with the story, so let me back out of here. Alright. So we go Campagna campaign. Let's do it. Alright. Oh, and by the way, sorry if I'm... Hey there. See, sorry if I'm speaking a little quieter, but um, uh, let's leave the shop. We have some people who are uh, some people who are sleeping, some people who are getting ready for work around here. And it's, uh, it's like 4.46 in the morning, so, you know, sorry if it sounds like ASMR comforting, you know, uh, voice. Um, now, there's one person you can miss in free duel at this point of the game. So let me see if this uh, takes us into more story. I'm gonna cancel, but let's hit the Pharaoh's Palace here. I think we can duel this person now, and still, you know, duel everyone else. Prince Flamon Fourteen, you return, my liege. It is well into the night. Please return to the palace, dear Prince. If you still wish to play cards, ah, yes, 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 good, good, good. Then try your hand against me. If you lose, you must return to your room. Yeah, we don't want to do that. I'm sure you'll find me a worthy opponent. Is that so, Simon? Uh, well, uh, yeah, let's, uh, if you hit pass, you'll actually head into story stuff and skip a bunch of people, which we don't want to do. Let's hit do. Ho, 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 my dear prince, I taught you the game. Oh, really? Oh, okay, cool. You don't really think you're going to win, do you? Ha! <laughs> Prepare yourself. And, uh, <laughs> speaking of tutorial episodes, which I did last time, uh, this guy is Simon. Oh, poor old Simon. <sighs> even easy, dare I say it? He's even easier than Taya. Yeah, so let's try a machine and a beast. That might get a pretty cool looking, oh. Maybe not. I thought that would make a Gigatech Wolf, but uh, we don't even have to make our strongest fusions here. Simon is so, so easy. Uh, but anyway, how are you guys doing today? Uh, today is May 12th, 2023. Uh, let's just try a Fiend and an Eye. Uh, yeah, it's currently... Uh, um... You might hear some uh, rumbling, actually. Uh, we, we're having some storm clouds moving and hey, that's good because, yeah, I, I know we're not even into June yet, but it is hot, hot here. It, well, it's it's usually humid here. Well, you, well, you guys know, I've, I've talked about how the weather, you know, kind of worked. Oof, man, what a frightening looking dual monster. <laughs> That, that thing kind of looks like Burning Skull Head from Yu-Gi-Oh! 5Ds, that's funny. Um, but, yeah, th thank God we're getting some rain. I'm telling oh, man. Toxic Belly Breath. That's a pretty cool attack, dude. <laughs> oh, man, that's so funny. There's some legitimately funny attacks and animations in this game. And, uh, uh, seeing the, uh... <laughs> Not gate D, what I was laughing at there, but the seeing the skull laugh and stuff. That, that was pretty cool, not gonna lie. Alright. And we'll go I direct attack. But uh, yeah, thankfully we're getting some rain and yeah, hopefully we'll get some rain for a couple days in a row. Kinda cool stand around here. Uh, but anyway, I hope you guys are faring better. Oh, Guardian Star. Key Mace. Beat us by 200. Alright. So, let's go next. Uh, as we know, this makes Lord of the Lamp. I've done this fusion a couple times now. I wonder... Wait, what? Oh, no, it's... Is it with a spellcaster? Anyway, let's see what eyes got. Yeah, maybe I... Yeah, oh, it is a spellcaster, because, uh... A couple episodes ago, I did two lamps. Yeah, yeah, I did two lamps, yep. And that made, uh, Lord of the Lamp. I wonder if you can get into... I'm gonna try some more lamp fusions um, throughout this let's play. Uh, I wonder if you can eventually get into La Jin, the mystical genie of the lamp, because that'd be a 
Wow. Laser eye. Nice. Yeah, because La Jin? 1800? That'd be a above average fusion uh, this early in the game. I'm assuming La Jin was. Yeah, yeah. I mean, come on, come on. La Jin, the mystical genie of the land. That's, a, that's such an iconic type of card. Like, it has to be in this game. There's no way. There's no way it's not. There's no way it's not. Alright, so Simon did a little damage to us, which is quite frankly shocking. But uh, anyway, so we have this guy. So let's try a new fusion. A machine and a warrior. Yeah. Fusion hall. And we get the cyber soldier. We remember this guy from uh, Duels of the Roses. That's his, oh, great. I know the Shadow Spectre good. This guy's good for laughs. <laughs> you know what? Maybe I can afford to turn it up a little bit. Hang on. Let me uh, Let's go with 20. Or 21. 21 should be, you know, still, you know, like I said, I'm not trying to wake people up and stuff. What you got, Cyber Soldier? Headbutt. Right. Oh, and let me keep an episode. Uh, check of time. It is 4.52. Okay. I don't know what time we started yet, but I'm going to stop at, uh, at uh, 5.12. Because that'll be 20 minutes. Yeah, surprisingly, that last episode was 31 minutes. I, I didn't think, like... I haven't cleared that much stuff off of my cell phone, you know, for the memory. I didn't think we'd get that long of an episode, to be quite frankly, but hey, you know, the I did like the commentary, the commentary and like, you know, the advice on the pointers I was given, I thought was solid, so thankfully it didn't cut off because I would have been very, very upset. So, anyway, another Saab soldier. Uh, oh man, I forgot what sign I made the other one. Let's try Mars. Oh, good, good, good. Okay, so you guys just saw a Cyber Soldier attack. I'm so glad we got to do this. Yeah, so for... This game actually doesn't have just one animation. Check it out, check it out. This game has... Two. Two animations per monster. And that is like... Dude, they went all... I love this game. <laughs> you know what I mean? They went all out for this game. Not only the 3D models, you know, for old school uh, PlayStation, but two? Oh, dude. That looks so cool. <laughs> He's using like pin missile there. Oh, that is awesome. Okay, I'm choosing Mars like every time. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Cyber Soldier doing the fist pump there, the fist pump. But yeah, the pin missile is definitely the cooler attack. But yeah, they went all out for this game, man. Uh, two animations per month. That that's that's awesome. That's awesome. I love it. Uh, but yeah, we're definitely gonna go with uh, which one was pin missile? Uh, Mars. Yeah, yeah. We're definitely picking Mars for Cyber Soldier the rest of the game. You know, you know, as long as I'm showing the animation. You know. If I'm just Going quick, 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 and better. Wow! Oh, he actually beat us. Funny, yeah, Musk. Okay. I think that card confused with some stuff. Anyway, we won here. So, like I said, when you're about to win, just you know, try some random stuff you normally wouldn't try. You know. We, like, like I said, we got this in the bag. We can afford to kind of mess around. Uh, let's go with earrings. <laughs> Sorry, every time I say that in this game, it's gonna be ooh. And let me show you guys how the Guardian Star works. So we have Mars. He has what is that? Jupiter or oh whatever he has. Uh, we've got the advantage. So and that's how that works. Get an extra five hundred. And let's see pin missile in stereo. Let's watch. So yeah, Simon, pretty easy here, but it's pretty easy to miss him. Um, if you don't duel Simon, uh, you know, if you don't come back to the palace relatively early, uh, you can miss Simon altogether. Pin missile! Oh, man, that's cool. 
Uh, yes, yeah, so make sure to come to the palace, um, fairly quickly, you know, um, if you're, you know, if you want to unlock everybody, but, but if you don't care, you know, uh, to unlock some, and then don't worry about it, but, you know, but this is a let's play, and, uh, I gotta show everything, so, you know, there's that. Oh, I love the UN music. All right, Simon, what you got for us, buddy? Probably nothing too good, but, you know. Well, actually, that's pretty good. White dolphin. I don't think we had any fish monsters before. So, let's see what he has to say. You won, drat. It would seem that I taught you well. You've grown strong, Fledman 14. Thank you, Simon. You've won fair and square. As promised, you may go. I have nothing more to say. All right, well, see ya. Uh, later, I guess. I guess we're, we're free. All right, and, uh, yeah. Gonna save, uh, I'm, I'm gonna spat, uh, sporadically save in this game because, uh, yeah, as I mentioned in the tutorial section, uh, losing, which, which can't happen, you know, sometimes you can just get a bad hand. And losing is game over, and that's, that's not fun. That's not fun. And not to mention the glitches, am I right, guys? That, that's the real reason we're saving Glitch City. <laughs> Oh, man. All right, so let's head back to the dual ground, and hopefully I haven't missed anyone here either, especially since I just saved. Um, but yeah, there's one person I want to try to beat today. Yeah, jeez, who did that maid think he is anyway, A eh, blood? <laughs> I know, right? What a guy. Uh, oh, hang on, hang on. Uh, oh, okay, yeah, sorry if you guys heard something, uh, something just popped up on my phone, I thought the video stopped, but, uh, no, it says we're still recording, but, uh, weird. Anyway, who does that maze think he is anyway? And I gotta admit, though, the guy was real tough. Oh, you're talking about, uh, the, the Seto Kaiba lookalike? Did he say his name? I think he did. Hey, Blood914, how about a game to that guy comes back? Um, let's try to duel someone else. I think if we duel against Joey, hey, afraid of starting off on the wrong foot, eh? I can understand that. Let's wait for the mage. You know, the guy's real tough. Listen, I play, oh, man, we're getting like a lot of dialogue here from Jono. I play here day in and day out, and you know, I'm pretty good. Fact is, there ain't too many duels I can't beat. But that mage, <laughs> Man, he's good. I didn't have a chance. Listen, Floodmon14, don't underestimate the guy. Oh, okay, Jono, okay. I never knew you got this much dialogue for saying pass. I know you're good, buddy, but don't get sloppy. There he is. He's back. Oh, if you hit pass, you go straight to... Interesting. Okay. Um... Look at that. He's got his own whoopies. I didn't know, like, I thought you had to beat Jono for this, but, well, anyway. Do me a favor and whip the guy. Oh, you got it, Jono. Do it, Flatmon14. <laughs> All right, Tiana. I'll try. Uh, by the way, I didn't know this was going to happen. Uh, my plan was to unlock, uh, basically there's like four or five other people we can unlock here. And my plan was actually to unlock them and then go into free duel, but, uh, yeah, we even might actually lose here. <laughs> Hello, Floodmod14. I don't know how good you are. <laughs> are you a third-rate duelist? But I hope you'll entertain me. <laughs> I will have you know that I enjoy a good game. Do not disappoint me. All right, Seto. I'll try not to. But when you go against this guy, pull out all the stops and we do want to put this in the deck real quick so let's go to let's see if we see any insects over here like I said you definitely want to get rid of those first uh fiends don't fuse with too much either so if you're out of insects you know there you go I, I would suggest getting rid of you know possibly possibly getting rid of fiends next some fiends do fuse some don't uh yeah so we'll get rid of this guy <laughs> it's so weird seeing uh that as an effect as a vanilla monster in this game. It's actually an effect monster, real game. It forces your opponent to draw three. If they get any spells, they discard them. Hero Shadow Scout. 
All right, guys. Oh, listen to this music, man. And I'm trying to be quiet here, but this music is hype. Okay, fusions, fusions. Let's see if we have any good fusions. Um, hmm, not really. Uh, let's just get rid of some stuff. I kind of want to keep this for cyber source, but uh, let's get rid of these two guys. And let's go defense mode. And hopefully you guys, will, well, actually, hopefully he, you won't see how powerful this guy is because, uh, yeah, oh, you know what? Beaver Warrior, Beaver Warrior is, we, we can, we can handle that. We can handle that. Um, there are way worse things you could have played. So let's get rid of this fairy, uh, the dino, I think, and this should fuse. No, okay, okay, uh, well, 1250, we are stronger, yeah? Yes, we are. Okay. All right. Check it out. Oh, in time, time. Okay, we're, I think we're good on time. It's only 501, so, and I said uh, 512, right? Okay. All right. Time to battle. Ocelo hero? <laughs> the original hero monster. Now get him, Flame Wing Man. No, I'm just kidding. What's this guy gonna do? Ah, more Thundershock animation, huh? Yeah. I'm cool with that, uh, I'll see you all hero as long as you don't glitch my game, buddy. Hey, <laughs> look, look at this little cape. Ah, he's so cute. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, not a bad, uh, not a bad monster. Not bad. I thought that would make Sword Arm of Dragon. It doesn't, uh, Duels of the Roses. You know, a dino and a warrior, but I guess it doesn't work here. Or maybe it does, and, um... Maybe it does work, and uh, let's go with this. Yeah, maybe it does work, and Auxilio Hero is a uh, is a false warrior. And we get the Stone D. Yeah, check that out. Uh, maybe this card's like a false warrior, you know, kind of like I was talking about Mio Toko. Ooh, we got the Guardian Star Mars. Let's do it. Beaver Warrior again. Uh, by the way, by the way, Kaiba, that's my monster. You better take good care of my beaver. What, what, why does Kaiba have Beaver? I mean, they couldn't give him Pet in the Dark Clown? Well, I guess Beaver Warrior does have 1,200 attack, though. I mean, but where's his Hutatsumi Giant, man? <laughs> that's like that's like a signature monster. I don't know. It's so weird just seeing him use Yuki's monsters at all. Which got Stone D. It's kind of like a, it looked kind of like flamethrower, but it was smoke. So, fire breath? I don't know. Stone D looks cool, though. Check that out. All right, all right, we're doing good here. And are we still recording? Sorry, I'm getting a little worried. Oh, okay, yeah. Especially after seeing that notification on my phone. But, uh, yeah, looks like we're still good. I'll see Leo Harrow, get him. All right, so he's down to 6,700. We still haven't lost any life points yet, which is a problem. I jinxed it, guys. Wicked World Beast. You know what? That's a signature kind of card. That's what I like to see. All right. Oh, like I said, let's try this with a spellcaster this time. Yeah, get in. <laughs> uh, reminds me of Naruto. Ah, so yes. Lamp plus spellcaster equals Lord of the Lamp. I'm going to try to get this guy into La Jin, but, uh, okay, so these guys tie. And we already saw a Stone D attack, so let's just get Wicked Worm Beast out of here. Hopefully he won't destroy Lord of the Lamp, and I'll draw the other lamp so I can just see if we can make La Jin. Yeah. But if not, we'll try it in a different episode. Uh, by the way, I didn't mention it in the tutorial episode, but I probably should have. Uh, yeah, try not to take uh, any... Uh, and I, and I, I get it if you're new, you know what I mean? Like... What I'm about to say probably won't make any sense, but try not to take any damage and try to use your Guardian Star as much as possible. Um, if you have the advantage in Guardian Star and you use it a lot, the game will kind of recognize that and give you a better rank. Uh, most of the time, you know what I mean? And also, uh, try not to take too much damage. Um, you know, the less damage you take, you take, uh, the better your rank will be, for sure. So, yeah. All right, what you got, Flare Wolf? You still got the, uh, the Bonkai? Oh no, Supersonic. Supersonic, Electronic, Hypnotic, Bonky Fresh. 
that looked up like a powerful uh, roar of a supersonic. I like that one. That's a pretty cool animation. I thought he was going to do the uh, pedal blizzard like he does in Duelist of the Roses, but uh, roar, zombie maru. Nice job, Flower Wolf. Proud of you. And we didn't take any damage there, so. All right. One more turn we got. All right, well. Good, good. And let's in. After this duel, like I said, I didn't know you could pass on the Joey duel. Um, but after this duel, I'm gonna see if we can duel, uh, let's just try a bunch of random stuff. Uh, cause we've won. But I'm gonna make sure we can, we didn't, uh, we can still duel against Jono. Cause I definitely want to unlock him. Uh, but let's just go with Stone D. Uh, yeah, cause I didn't know you could hit pass there, but he gave like a lot of dialogue that I've never even seen before in this game, so... I'm kind of glad we did hit pass there. Um, cause he, he gave a lot of backstory about himself, and uh... Yeah, so... Uh, ooh, that's a pretty good drop. You get Clown Zombie, alright. Pretty good monster. Uh, just like in the real game, it's got 1350. Pretty good. Uh, uh, Flood Mod, I, I can't believe I lost. My Blue Eyes is furious. Oh yeah, where was your Blue Eyes, buddy? You didn't summon it. <laughs> but, oh, double take. Wait a moment, you. You are. <laughs> uh, I see. Mm. Well enough, Flood Mod 14. That's all for today. Now, Mokuba, find me my ancient Egyptian ship. Uh, a galley or whatever you call it. I have to go up the Nile, but I have a feeling our paths will cross elsewhere. Hmm, is that so? Till then, I bid you farewell. <laughs> yeah, you did blow my 14. Okay, thanks, Jono. Did you see the look on his face? It was great, buddy. <laughs> Flood, you're just too good. Aw, oh, thanks, Tiana. I tried. Hey, hey, I bid you farewell. <laughs> what a loser. <laughs> uh, all right, Jono. But my 14, well, what now, buddy? Still got time? Yeah, still got time. Uh, so what happens if I hit play? Well, no, 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 let's... Okay, so what I'm gonna do... Yeah, we'll come around anytime, buddy. We'll be here. All right, Jono, appreciate it. Um, like I said, I want to make sure I didn't... Because I know I hit pass. I want to make sure I didn't skip Jono permanently. So let's head back to the dual ground before I save. Because once you save, there's no going back. Hey, blood, get back, buddy. Wanna play? Oh, thank God, you can duel, Jono. Okay, let's talk to, let me make sure we can duel everyone. So let's talk to someone else. Right, see ya, buddy. All right, I'm just checking to see, make sure we can, ah, uh, so see, okay. So see, you can miss Tayana here if you don't, uh, yeah, if you don't unlock her first. Cause she said, I think I'll be heading home. With what the festival and all, I'll last track with time. Okay, so see, you can't duel her. Talk to someone else. That was so duel. Uh, who are you? I never saw anything like that before. I was about giving me a chance. Come on, let's play a game. Uh, let's talk to someone else. I'm just making sure we can duel everyone. Did you manage to get any rare cards? Uh, who are you? I'll pay you for them if you want to. Uh, not quite yet, because I, I want to save first. You wanna play me, boy? Listen, boy, I learned how good you were the last time we, uh, we've never dueled before, buddy. But, hey, I don't like losing. Alright, so let's talk to someone else. It's getting pretty late, Flood. Wanna play another match? Alright, so, let's go outside. And I know it's a little spastic of me, but, uh, I think we can still duel everyone. So, um, I'm gonna end the episode here. And by the way, the, uh, yeah, the lineup you just saw, I do plan to unlock everybody. And you can only unlock them if you duel them and, you know, for free duel, if you duel them and you win. Uh, yeah, so thank you guys for joining me. Um, before I save, I'm actually going to off screen. I know I just kind of went out, you know, went outside and then back in. And uh, it looks like we still can duel everyone we need to. Thank God we dueled Tayana. Uh, early there. So yeah, be sure to duel. Apparently you can miss Tayana and 
uh, assignment pretty easily there. So be sure to duel Teyana as soon as you see her, like first thing, first thing. Um, because after the thing with Seto there, apparently she doesn't feel like dueling anymore. But um, yeah, I'm gonna end the episode here and then I'm gonna basically double check what I just did, make sure we can still duel everyone and then I'm gonna save. So uh, yeah, thank you guys for joining me. Uh, and uh, next time we'll head back to the duel ground, see if we can unlock everybody. All right guys, see you guys next time. Bye-bye.